in this lecture, we're going to talk about the black body radiation uh, uh, spectral distribution. Um, so Boltzmann was the first person to try and describe the uh, spectral distribution of radiation from a black body. And what do I mean by a black body? A black body is a uh, theoretical object that is a perfect absorber and a perfect emitter at all wavelengths. There is no such object as a black body in the universe that we know of. Um, and so we refer to most things as gray bodies, which means that they're not perfect absorbers or perfect emitters at all wavelengths. They may be perfect at individual wavelengths, but not at all wavelengths. But the, the formulation that we're talking about here is for a theoretical black body object. And Boltzmann came up with a distribution for the black body radiation as 8 pi times a constant, which he uh, named as the Boltzmann's constant, uh, times temperature over wavelength to the fourth. And over here, this black line is essentially the formulation of Boltzmann for the uh, black body radiation distribution curve, uh, the spectral distribution. It has one problem, though. Uh, the problem is, is that at short wavelengths, the limit of this uh, distribution function uh, as the wavelength goes to zero goes to infinite, uh, goes to infinity. Um, so that would uh, indicate that there's an infinite amount of energy at those low wavelengths. And we refer to that as the ultraviolet catastrophe. Uh, and it's clearly not what was actually observed when measurements started to be uh, taken of black body radiation distribution. Um, the blue line is the actual observed spectra uh, for a black body uh, object. And so we have a very strong disconnect between the Boltzmann distribution and uh, the observed data uh, at short wavelengths. So what uh, happened is that Planck uh, came up with a solution to this by fitting an empirical function to the data. Uh, and this empirical function uh, is that the black body radiation distribution is equal to H, 8 pi hc, where h is now the Planck's constant, c is the speed of light, uh, divided by wavelength to the fifth times the exponential of this quantity hc over lambda kt minus 1. And that uh, formulation actually does a very good job of reproducing the data for black body radiation spectra. And that's the formulation for the black body radiation spectra that we will be using when we try and integrate underneath this curve to figure out the total amount of energy that is being emitted by an object, or we take a, a derivative of this function in order to find the wavelength of maximum emission. And those will be the next two steps that we do.